Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Outlast Part 2 Whistleblower DLC. So we made out that crazy situation with those people trying to stab us. Uh, looks like, oh crap, I just fell out the vent. <laughs> I'm off to a good start. Looks like everyone's uprising and taking over the um, insane asylum slash uh, laboratory. Bad idea. We get out of here through reception and then Merc Tactical clean it up. If they get here in time, we need help now. If we get them on the radio, the National Guard could be here within. We don't even know the radio works. Oh, it's shortwave. If the prison's got electricity, they've got signal and the lights are on. Merc off has under control. Yeah, I noticed. We need to get to that radio. Outside help doesn't come without outside attention. You want responsibility for every legally shaky thing you did on the Murkoff Company payroll? I know I don't. It's too late to worry about that. This just has to stop. You're scared. You're not thinking straight. Let me make something clear. You try to radio outside for help. I'm gonna give you a whole new something to be scared of. Are you threatening me? Yes. Shit, he's gonna lick his fucking face. You better not do it, buddy. I've seen what they do to people that try and torture. It's not pretty. Not fucking pretty. Okay. I can't remember what I was saying at the beginning, but I don't think it really matters. So, uh, let's carry on. Into the vents. I hope I haven't put anything in these now. I'm like, pretty okay in the vents now, but I won't be if they stop putting jump scares in. Shit, it's really dark. Look how dark it is. Fuck. Who? What's that? <gasps> what the fuck? Where did that guy even come from? Okay, I'll just push it, man. You just stay there and watch me and breathe really loudly. Okay. This game's slightly rapey. I'm out. Or oh, this DRC, rather. I'm gonna keep making that mistake, but it feels like a new game again. Hmm. Let me in. Let me in. Let me out. Let me somewhere. Okay, it looks like some shit went down here. Some real shit. Some sort of drive-by. Help me, please. I'm a doctor. I need to get hold of my... You're not security. I was... I'm a patient like you. Stole these clothes from a dead body I found. You gotta get me out of here. Please, just push the button. Open the door. We can get out of here together. This guy seems like he's gonna be a crazy motherfucker. But alright. No, no! No, no! 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 Ah! Remind me not to dress up as a doctor. Ever. Right, well that note's here. Oh, there's two notes. There's a radio in the prison, shortwave. If it's electronic, I can make it talk. Make it work for me. There's hope, Lisa. I'm coming home to you. My mistake was subtlety. Like you always said, I thought leaking information to a few generous was the safest way inside the workplace. I didn't want the spotlight, the attention. Murkoff is dangerous. I know that. I thought I had to be subtle for your sake, Lisa, for the boys. But I should have exposed what Murkoff is doing to the world. I should have shouted to anyone and everyone. I can't die. Not before I reach the radio. They can't cover this up now. It's too broken. It's too dangerous. The doctors are sick. 
I've never seen a man die before today. Never seen a dead body outside of a coffin. Dozens today, murdered and worse. I looked into a man's eyes as another tore him to pieces. Claimed he was a doctor, then saw the rags they've dressed me in and changed his story. Said he was a patient. Could have been either. They are all crazy, all sick. No real difference between them now. The therapy is spreading, and what am I? I watched this man die and only thought, it's not me, thank God. I know all d I'll die one. I, blah, 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 blah. I know I'll die someday. I don't want it to be murdered. I don't want to be murdered. Yeah, no one likes to be murdered or licked in the face. Both those things really suck. Don't know which one's worse. To be fair. What? <laughs> what? Not him again, fuck's sake. I thought he was gone. Another one's coming! Another what? Where'd I go? Fuck. Let's go check where he came from for batteries. I can't resist the urge to find batteries. It's too strong. Huh? Oh. <laughs> I thought that was a gap. I didn't realize that's just a glass door. If this is real life, I would have smacked my face pretty badly there. Any batteries around here? No. But I have found a document that's almost as good as a battery. Oh, it's not one of these, is it? Well, I can't read it. From J Blair at Murkoff Corp, US.com, to H Grant at Murkoff Corp, US.com. Subject Resignation for Mental Health, CC8208. Miss Grant, you may receive requests for information from Mrs. Lisa Park of Leadville Co. in the coming weeks concerning the resignation and hospitalization of her husband, Waylon. If so, please forward them to the, my personal attention. Waylon Park, Former consulting contract 8208 resigned due to previously undiagnosed mental illness. I personally visited Mrs. Lisa's Park and her sons and broke the news to them with the silver lining that Murkoff Psychiatric Psychiatric <laughs> would be graciously providing treatment. Mrs. Park had some less than charitable things to say about herself, myself, and the Murkoff Corporation. I assured her that with her power of attorney, she could try to fight the doctor's diagnosis of her husband's illness. However, if it were discovered that he resigned under false pretenses, his insurance would be cancelled and the family would be saddled with not insignificant healthcare debts. Hopefully she understood, but if she insists on making a nuisance of herself or tries to get around me, please let me know. This is one I want to take care of personally. Yours, Jeremy Blair. Oh, he seems like a nice guy. Yeah. Seems like a nice guy. Now where the hell do I go again? It is the question on my mind every second of this game. Don't know why I bothered. I mean, that's obviously going to be locked. <laughs> and this is boarded off. Just take in my environment quickly. Time for a bit of parkour. Or I can just get stuck. Oh. It feels like I can get up this way. Oh shit, I fell down. No. Yes. Yes. No, I can't get up on that. Too far. Too much parkour for this guy. Who? Superman jump. Okay, I definitely heard something there. As long as it's not the wall rider, I think I'm okay. Because that wall rider is creepy as hell. Damn, this guy can't parkour at all. Look at him. Failed on the first jump. I should have left my light on. Fucking. <laughs> I forgot I got less batteries in this one. 
need to conserve them and look for them at any time by wasting them. I just circled around and wasted all my batteries for no reason. Any batteries on you? Come on, you got some batteries. Holding out on me, aren't you? Fucker. Shit, okay. I probably didn't actually need it here. That red light actually really helps. Yeah, I'm actually wasting it. <laughs> but it looks so cool! Wow, that guy fell out of bed really badly. You know what they say, get out the wrong side of the bed in the morning and that's your day ruined for the rest of the day. There's actually no batteries anywhere. There must be something. I need my battery fix. Come on guys. Give me my fix. Fuck, I'm not sure I want to go in there. That guy's eating another guy, I think. Or he's licking his face, either one. No, he's definitely eating him, he's definitely eating him. Fucking hell. Oh. oh he's, he's cooking something as well. Oh, I love this. Hand carbonara, my favorite. I'm not sure I want to go interrupt this guy. Oh shit, I pressed my button. Oh. Okay. It's good that I didn't open anyway. Oh, he's in this one. Never mind. Like, can't see anything. You use up too much batteries. Oh, he stopped eating as well, shit. He must be really full now, though. I would be about to say a whole human. <laughs> shit. What's he doing? Okay. Alright, this one's definitely a lot more sexual than the last one. Fucking hell. This um, takes heavy petting to a new level. Oh, I was going to read that note I just got. In the cannibal's kitchen. <clears throat> Don't ask to see my body, Lisa, when I die. When you finish the lawsuits that let you pry this footage from Murkoff's army of lawyers and corporate hitmen, don't make them show you my body. Just bury it or burn it. Let my sons remember me whole. That man is eating human flesh. He looks at me and I see anger. A little desire, but more than anything, anger, uh, anger, hunger. Please don't make them show you my body. This guy's given up really quick. Damn. He's like, I'm dead. I'm gone. I don't know why you're even bothering to walk anymore. He just, he just thinks he's dead. I reckon he can make it out. This needs a bit of positive thinking. A bit of positivity. Oh god, okay, here we go. Now what's that? Should do like they do in the films. Like, come out, show yourself. I know you're there. <laughs> no, that's gonna work in this game. Fuck. Give me that battery. Fuck. So don't jump out at me, please. Don't jump out at me. Okay. No, no trippy shit. Oh my. Oh. I 
are stuck in the door then. Those doors are the bane of my existence. I had the key. I guess not. Time for some parkour. <coughs> oh, thank god that one's locked. That looks really dark in there. I mean, what a shame. Locked doors, damn it. Damn it. Is that the, is that the cannibal? Oh, fuck's sake. I'm not teabagging him, I was actually trying to crouch. <laughs> Fuck. What am I walking into? Oh, uh, desk upside down. Or on its side. Oh god, the batteries ran out really quick in this one. Maybe because I'm on a hard difficulty though. Oh, I'm scared to peek this, I don't want to peek it. Oh shit, that music's getting louder. Okay, I'm gonna pick it, I'm gonna pick it. Oh, it looks kinda safe. Mine! You were mine! Oh, fuck. Shit. <gasps> He's fast. He's fast. Let me in, let me in, let me in. Shit. Do you leave? I feel like he's faking me out. I honestly can't tell if he's left or he's fucking with me. Okay, I'm gonna try and move. I'm wasting battery. Oh. Shit, 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 shit. Battery? Oh, fuck, you're just light. God, you're useless to me. Useless. Okay, okay, there must be something here. Why is it illuminated? Why is it illuminated? Come on, there must be something. Oh. God damn it. Okay. Oh, he broke down this door. Not that one on the left, on the right. Shit, this music. It's creeping me out. Well, I haven't got much battery left. I can't hear any footsteps at all. <gasps> That's close. Literally so fucking close. Am I going the wrong way? I feel like I'm going the wrong way. Yeah, I feel like I've gone backwards. Shit. 
I'm gonna have to do that run again, I think. Yeah. Fuck. I can <gasps> Cool, that made me jump. I thought I'm dead. I'm dead, yeah. Shit. Oh my god. Yeah, the enemies are definitely more intelligent on a harder difficulty. Which is nice, actually. I quite like um, the difficulty. Alright. How many batteries have I got? Okay, I got a full recharge on that. That's cool. Don't know why I tried that. I knew that was going to be locked again. Because I remember commenting saying that was a very dark room. I'm glad I didn't have to go in there. Right. Oh my god, he's next to me! This guy is so sneaky! Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Is he breaking the wrong door down again? Yes, yes he is. He's in there somewhere. Okay, I need to try and find the exit. I mean, obviously, but I mean... I need to do it better. <laughs> do it a lot better than last time. Last time, I ended up slightly dead. Ever so slightly. Doesn't help that I can't hear footprints. Prince? Steps. Shit, he's still in there. Okay, he's gone right, so I'm gonna go left. I've definitely checked this place out before. Alright, let's look up on the ceiling quickly. See if there's a here we go. Here we go. Get the fuck out of here. Oh shit. Friendly, right? What the fuck? Before you tell me a secret, let me just grab this battery. Want a secret? Any documents here before I leave? Jesus Christ! Put the handcuff key. Goodbye. I feel like I missed out on an opportunity for a weakest link joke there. Cool. That's really bad posture. He's gonna have a, such a bad back in the morning. Fucking hell. I mean, I thought my posture was bad. Alright, document. I love reading these things. Ginger selection in Mount Massive Contractors. Holy shit. Form note. All material heroin. Heroin? Herein. <laughs> heroin. Herein to be transcribed according to Form 4083. With forensic revisions as benefits ongoing lawsuit. One... Two zero zero seven one five. Author Ethan Skrishkandaraja. This is a request for a specific legal consultation in the ongoing lawsuit by Melissa Cho against Murkoff Charitable Psychiatric Tree Inc. USA. Originally filed in 2010. At the time of Miss Cho's termination, the psychosomatic effects of the morphogenic engine on female employees and patients have been well established. Already more than seven female employees and patients had reached fictitious, fictitious half-term pregnancies in a matter of weeks before miscarrying the non-existent children, five of them fatally. Female employees were moved to higher floors in the facility, then to other buildings and eventually entirely off of the Mount Massive facility. The critical secrecy of Project Wall Rider necessitated necessitated Secrecy in the motivating factor for the reassignments and terminations, resulting in perceived injustice from several terminated parties. Mrs. Cho has succeeded in acquiring a court-ordered FOIA release of the documents surrounding her termination. 
Those documents will need to be generated and post-dated, providing almeliating information while skirting the relevant secrecies of the project. Please advise. Efren, random crazy fucking name, consultant MM214. Yep, as usual, they don't make those any easier to read. I definitely need to get some sort of handbook on how to say really big words like that. So I think I am very behind on the times and how people speak. Right, where was I? Looking for handcuffs. <gasps> Fuck me! Shit. Shit, shit, shit. God damn it. They're trying to kill me. In game and in real life. Right, anyway, that's the end of part two. <laughs> like, subscribe, and I'll catch you in part three. Take care.